again. So on behalf of the class of 2009, I say yes to this divine call. I say yes to all that comes with it, I say yes. And I invite you all to say yes with me, for this time is transformed. This class of ministers is transforming our world. And when we leave today, we will no longer be the same. And for that, I am so grateful. <laughs> Namaste. So I've been asked to speak a word of blessing for this class today, and I think you'll agree with me that it's somewhat gilding the lily to bless this class because they in fact are blessing us. But I would like to take the opportunity now to mark this place in time because this is an eternal now moment, and there is no question that all who have gone before us, all the great mystics, the priests, the shamans, the holy men from the beginning of the human race, that we stand on their shoulders, but we also stand with them today in this eternal now. And we look into the future and know that this wonderful light that is shining in white here is part of the plan, is part of the light of this world that is coming, and it is brighter every single day. And in this moment, we are one in the heart with this class. And so let's just let the outer world fall away for a moment and move into that eternal knowing, that place of consciousness, that place of the infinite, that place of the amazing, beautiful spirit that is endless, that is seamless, that is completely realized in this moment and in every moment. And so I'm letting go in this moment for any quest of any questions about the future, of any questions of individuality here and just resting in that amazing, endless spirit of the infinite God. And I'm calling forward into this eternal now, that full realization of the beauty of the divinity, of the love, of the heart, of these new ministers of God. And knowing for each person here that at that individual level, at the individual heart level, this is true of each person here, that each is called. And today, in some way, each is saying yes to being that full manifestation of their individual selves. And this too is part of the blessing of this class to remind each person here to just simply settle into being in each life, the fullness and the power of God. And so I know that in each day forward, as this class moves forward into ministry, I know that they are the blessing, that they are the light, that it is already so, that it has been ordained, and that the vast and amazing love of God carries them, nurtures them, sustains them, uplifts them, lifts them on these great wings and that our world is in such good hands, and we are all a part of it. These are our teachers, they are our lovers, they inspire us, they are the infinite itself, and we look upon them with joy. And so I just give great thanks for this day, knowing that we are all blessed, and I'm so grateful for it, and so it is. And so for the conferring of degrees, I'll welcome back Dr. Kathy Hearn. So this is the moment uh, that we have been waiting for and I would like to ask our practitioners to stand and our ministers to stand. <laughs> this is the sacred, just about to be sacred, tassel toss moment. <laughs> and so I declare by the power of God 
and by the authority of God and by the great blessing of United Centers for Spiritual Living vested in me, I do hereby declare the official completion and achievement of these new spiritual titles of minister and practitioner of truth. You may move your tassels. Congratulations to you and all of us. Thank you so much.